Finally, somebody came up with a cordless handheld vacuum that you can use to detail your car, and it's the Fantic V8 Mate. Now it's small, compact, looks modern and sleek. However, does it have enough power to do the job? You're gonna find out by watching this video. I'm gonna go over all the features. We're gonna do the unboxing so you can see all the accessories it comes with, and I'm gonna give you my final thoughts. So without further ado, let's go ahead and start the show. Hey guys, I'm Pam, welcome to the show. I hope you guys are having a great day. So let's dig right into it. I'm reviewing the new Fantic V8 Mate, a cordless handheld vacuum, perfect for use in the car detailing world. So I'm gonna give you, of course, all the features, but quickly go check the links in the description under the video because I have a feeling once this video drops a lot of people are going to be buying it and I have a feeling it's going to be back ordered for a while uh, it has a lot of cool things going for it and we're going to talk about all that uh, but again I'll drop the links in the description under the video for you guys to check them out so all you have to do is sit back relax and enjoy the show also quick disclaimer this is not a sponsored video nobody paid for this video I ordered this myself on Amazon USA at the time of this recording we're in early May uh, these sell anywhere from 70 to 80 US dollars depending on which color you get because you can get this in black uh, blue or white if memory serves me well uh, this in Canadian dollars because I live in Canada once I imported it uh, thanks to all the taxes and import fees came to around 111 Canadian dollars so these units are made in China unsurprisingly however the build quality is actually very very good so it has this matte appearance I think they nailed that it looks modern it looks sleek and as you can tell it's very compact so what are the the characteristics first of all let's go over the specs so this one here weighs in at a very lightweight 1.2 pounds uh, that's 540 grams it comes with a bunch of accessories uh, in the box we're going to do the unboxing so you can see uh, what accessories it comes with uh, it's pretty jam-packed and it has uh, two modes so the normal operating mode the battery will last roughly 30 minutes I get anywhere in real world 28 to 29 minutes uh, but the better use for this for car detailing is to put it in turbo mode and they say you get up to 12 minutes in turbo mode in real world conditions I got 9 to 10 minutes so still very very good uh, does this vacuum by the way replace your normal um, shop vac or wet and dry vacuum no of course it doesn't I have a rigid four gallon five horsepower uh, wet and dry vacuum and of course that's the one I use uh, the majority of the time for all the big work right so this is more for when you're finally delivering uh, the vehicle to the customer a few minutes before they come if there's any touch-up work to do uh, or for some light duty work uh, you can store this in either your door bin uh, or inside your uh, glove box or wherever you want it in your vehicle carry it with you for example if you're a uh, father or a mother of a family uh, you have kids you go on a road trip they spill some stuff on the floor there's some crumbs uh, whatever have you not well you can use this uh, to pick that up so for any light duty work this is great because you don't have to bust out your big vacuum you just take this it's handheld uh, thanks to by the way it's USB charging port here in the back this is how you charge it uh, from a dead battery all the way to 100% takes roughly two hours to charge for the power itself uh, on the uh, the box they talk about 12 kilopascals of suction power that equates to roughly 30 air watts of suction power uh, and I got to give credit where credit is due by the way I found out about this vacuum thanks to my uh, buddy uh, I'm Josh V or Josh she has that YouTube channel called I'm Josh V another car detailer shout out to Josh by the way uh, and so he actually tested this and it surpasses the claimed um, numbers from the manufacturer so he actually got 13 kilopascals uh, of suction power so it's pretty good again it doesn't replace your full-blown vacuum guys make sure you take note of that this is more uh, for that uh, kind of um, spot treating uh, if you drop something or again that light duty work before you deliver the vehicle back to the customer if somehow it, it got dirty again uh, but thanks to all the tools it comes with and the accessories well it gets into a lot of nooks and crannies so I'm gonna show you what it's all about first of all if you guys want to hear the sound of course this is compact so it's not as loud as your traditional uh, bigger vacuum but just so you guys can have an idea so you power it on uh, thanks to the button here so let's have it here at that So blue and now if I put turbo mode it goes green so back to tur back to normal mode and then you shut it off so it's not that loud of course because it is so compact uh, you can hold this super well in your uh, in your hands and uh, yeah let's go ahead and see all the accessories that are in there 
All right, guys, so let's have a look at what comes inside the box. First of all, good job with the packaging itself. It looks modern and sleek, just like the V8 Mate itself. So when you open it up, you're going to see your user manual. Then you have this, well, thanks for choosing your uh, V8 uh, Mate. So you get a USB charging cable. This tool here, this is my favorite one because it stretches out. So you take your vacuum, you simply connect the tool just like so. And then you have this here, it's a crevice tool, so you go all over the place uh, in your vehicle. So this is super practical and again, very compact. So look at that. You can store that pretty much anywhere you want in your vehicle. And all the accessories are detachable. So you take that out. You also have this tool here. So this is a multi-use brush because on top now I have this accessory. So this is a pet hair brush. It has this kind of rubbery fingers or rubbery textures. Uh, it does a great job at that. And you can slide it out if you want and just use the multi-tool itself. It has kind of this velvet padding, and then it's super simple. You simply slide the top part if you want to use this to uh, vacuum up any pet hair. Again, easy clip on, it clips on like this, and you can use it to brush your, uh, your carpets or floor mats, so that's pretty cool. What else do we have? We have this uh, other little brush that can be great to use for your air vents, for example, or anywhere else. I wouldn't use this on a gloss piano black though. They're a bit stiff, but for uh, pretty much the majority of the surfaces in the vehicle, other, other than that uh, lightweight, uh, other than that, I mean uh, lighter kind of stuff for the uh, gloss black, I wouldn't necessarily do that, but for anything else, it's pretty good. So this is what it looks like. Very compact, as you can tell. Other than that, you have this little brush here that you can use to clean the filters. I'm going to show you the interior of the vacuum and how easy it is to operate. And you get this practical bag that you can store your vacuum in from Fantic. So they did a great job with the accessories. Now, let's have a look at the vacuum itself. So how you operate this is pretty simple. So if you look at it, first of all, for the canister, they have this locking tab mechanism. So you would just pull that down and you push the button. So you don't even have to touch it with your hands, the, the filters inside there. You emptied it in the garbage bin and that's it. You clip it back, you put that safety pin and there you go, it's good to use. So you don't have to touch anything. Now, if we look at the unit in the back, you're gonna see that there's this locking and unlocking tab and you get this dot. So you line the dot, the dot up, you put it on the unlocking and there you go, you remove the um, unit itself. So here, there's this little handle, and what you do, you simply pull the filtration units. So it has a double filter, first of all, it has this outer metal jacket filter, and then you look here in the back, and it says to turn it this way to open it, or clockwise to close it. So if we click to open it, there you go, you remove it, here, you have your HEPA filter, which by the way, you can replace. I'll have links to the replacement filters in the description. They say to change these every three months or so, but you can brush them up if it's not that dirty. And the same thing, you can wash and rinse the uh, metal filter. And then they have these locking tabs on the filter. You simply take your HEPA filter, line those tabs up, and then you close it. You hear this satisfying click. And then you take your filtration unit, you simply slide that back in, and then when you go to put this, you take the dot on the uh, unit, you're gonna align it back onto the unlocking position, just like so, and then you lock it up, click, that's it. So now the line and the uh, locking lined up, and you're good to go. So very, very smart, very well built, and as you can tell, it comes with all the accessories that you need. So what do you guys think of the Fantic V8 Mate cordless handheld vacuum? Uh, again, I think it has a lot of jam-packed value for money. Uh, this is one of the first ones that I finally find is pretty decent for some lightweight work uh, when doing detailing. I look forward to using this more and more in the coming months. Uh, again, it's compact, well-designed, has all the accessories you need, uh, just enough power to, uh, to do the job for some quick light touch-ups or light use. Uh, I'll drop the links to all of this in the description under the video for you guys to check them out. I hope you enjoyed the video. Uh, let me know, are you gonna cop one of these? Do you think it's something that you would add to your arsenal? Do you like the idea? Drop a comment in the comment section. And guys, in the meantime, don't forget, keep it tight, keep it clean, and I'll see you on the next one.